Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for tuning in. So I've got a little bit of a cold today, but that is not stopping me from getting out and fishing. Today we're gonna be wading up this creek here into the main river and hoping to land some smallmouth bass as well as some other fish species. This river is an awesome spot around me that has a bunch of different species, but of course the primary one being bass. We're gonna be targeting them, seeing what else we can hook into. Let's get down there and explore and see what we can do. So we've gotta wade down this shallow creek here to get to the main river. This is the best access here. And I actually tried fishing this last week and my footage got messed up. I got into a few fish that would have been nice for a video, but hopefully we'll get into more today. This creek doesn't really have much going on. There's some spots that look pretty nice like this little eddy up ahead here, but unfortunately there's not too much going on here. So let's keep walking, get down to the river. All right, and here we have it. We've reached the main river. See some nice current over there. A lot of slack water in here. So we're gonna try and fish this slack water right next to the main current where fish might be waiting for food. We got some deeper water here downstream. Let's start the casting in there. Maybe there'll be something in here that's hungry. Normally the rooster tail does pretty good, but today it just doesn't seem to be getting hit. We'll try it more upstream, but we're gonna switch up the bait now. First up, I'm just gonna switch it up to a bigger spinner bait. We're gonna see if one of these sort of Spinner baits will catch the attention of anything different. That's a fish. That's a fish right away. First cast on the new bait. What do we got? It's a good fighter. Oh, that's a nice smallmouth. That is a nice fish. Oh man. Look at this fight. See if we can beach him. Do not want to slack up this line. Man, that's a nice fish. Wow. Wow, that's one of my best smallmouth ever. Insane fish. What a beast. That is an insane smallmouth. Compared to the size of my fist, his head is really big. What a beautiful fish. He absolutely hammered that bait. It was one heck of a fighter. Well, let's let this beautiful fish go. He is off to the races. Incredible first catch of the day. Just what we wanted. If there's one, that hopefully means there's more. So I'm just gonna fan cast in here. Gonna cast to the left and then to the right and everywhere in between. Whenever you check out a new spot, always be sure to fan cast. You never know what's gonna take it. There's a little fish. Oh man, little sunfish. And we, I know exactly what I'm going to do with this. I got it in the sand a little bit, so it's a little dirty, but here we have it. Our bait, nice and bloody in there. Hopefully this will be what we need to catch a nice catfish. Going to use our makeshift rod holder right here and hopefully get a bite. moving.
caught some fish. Let's see if it'll hit again. That was a hard hit. There's stuff down there that wants this. Just saw a smallie swim right past. Cast that this way and see if he'll take it. I lost him, but he can't be too far. There we go. There we go. That's a smallmouth. That is most certainly a smallmouth. Probably the one I just saw. What a fighter. It's a decent sized one too. There we go, beautiful little fish. Not as big as the other one, but still a nice smallmouth. Toss him right back. He is off as well. There's a fish, first cast into this side. What do we got? Nice little large mouth. Look at that. That's awesome. Tiny little guy, but fun catch nonetheless. Let's toss him back. There's a fish on. Ah, look at that jump. What do we got? Got another largie. Now this guy has got a claw mark on him. Something must have attacked him. Maybe a bigger fish or an animal or something, but either way, nice little guy get him back in the water all right everyone that is going to do it for this video thank you all for tuning in i appreciate you watching i would have stayed out there for a lot longer had it not gotten dark and the fish bite kind of turned off towards the end there but i know that there were more fish hiding in that area and it's just an awesome spot, it looks beautiful, and I'm definitely gonna be back out there for future videos. I know there's monsters lurking beneath the surface. For the catfish rod, unfortunately we didn't catch anything on that, but I'm gonna throw on a hook that is not a circle hook and try some different spots there and hopefully hook up with some big fish there. So anyway, thank you guys for watching. Please be sure to leave a like if you enjoyed the video and subscribe if you wanna see more like it. I've got some awesome adventures coming soon, so you won't wanna miss them, but in the meantime, thank you guys for watching, and I'll talk to you in the next one. Later.